Good morning, good day my friends. We are going to continue today with our video reviews from Everyday Crafts. If you missed my previous video, please check them out. The product is beautiful, very, very good quality. And for today's video, we have four diamond paintings in here. And one of them, I think there's a Christmas in here. How about we start today with bigger canvas? Usually we always start with smaller one. We will change a little bit today, how about that? And let's keep going. I really like the product that we already review. They have a really good, I have to say that their website have a good price on a product. It's not very expensive. Some stores can be a little bit overpriced if you check them kind of, you know, from one store to another. You can pick your favorite price and also uh, depends where you are. Uh, some could be in pounds, some in euro, some in US dollar. Well, you can obviously change your money where you are to order in your uh, money value. I'm in Canada, so I'm usually if I would order that would be Canadian money. Now this is absolutely stunning image and we have already good news in here. Now we have a, a regular tool. They more and more I think start to put in a Ziploc bags which I really like and also I really like that they start to pack in a Ziploc bags. So I'm not going to probably even open this pack because they are packed so nicely. And what is it? I see last number here, 23. So maybe it's 23 colors. Yes. So we have a 23 colors in here. And let me just show you right now. They should be all in here as they packed by the number from lower to higher. So we're just going to see diamonds. Diamonds, as you can tell, it's a square diamonds. Looks like it's going to be very nice and bright. Picture is all those good juicy colors. Oh, beautiful, beautiful quality of diamonds. Good and the image itself is just stunning. It's stunning. With the dragonfly over the sky, I would say represent the sky. Now this flowers on the bottom looks so beautiful. Let me put sideways, that way reflection go away and you can see how gorgeous that look like. It's almost like a starry night, kind of on the top in here design. Love those transparent wings. If you wish, you can add some AB diamonds if you have in your stash. Love the flowers arrangement on the bottom as well. Canvas is super awesome quality. I can tell that print, print are so vibrant. Glue thickness in here, very good. Look at that, the glue in here looks nice and shiny and the quality of the print is so crispy clean. Love, love, love this one. Love this one. Do we remember something like this as a cross stitch? I feel like I see this image in a cross stitch somewhere. I just I can't remember where. But it's stunning. It's stunning. It's gorgeous. 23 colors. I think it's a good amount of colors. More would be, of course, better. At least, like, you know, 30, 35 I would put because it looks like very colorful image. But the way that I see colors right now as a print, it looks already good. So we should have a good quality image in here. All right, this is wonderful. Love it. Love, love, love. And of course I do love because they already pre-packed in the Ziploc bags. And those numbers are huge. I love when they print number like this on the bag. So later you can definitely reuse them if you have some diamond paintings that, um, come to you in a regular those long strips right so you can definitely reuse these bags by doing one two three four whatever and DMC code in here on a canvas we do have a DMC code in here it would be cool if they would print DMC code as well but 
that would be maybe waste of the bags a little bit because we don't have same DMC every single time. So by number from one to last number, that's good enough. Gorgeous, gorgeous image, gorgeous, love it. Check it out, all the links as usual will be on the end of this video, um, I mean under my video in the description box. Also, I will try to link it up all videos together that we already review with you. Now, this is another flowers, but this time we have a hummingbird together with it. Oh, two birds in here. I'm just trying to look. Okay, here. I'm trying to <laughs> look through the camera. Two birds. Colorful flowers. Uh, what's the name of this flowers, you think? Can't kind of tell on the website. I mean, can't really tell on a canvas. Um, did I told you just a minute for a second? I was so excited about this image. I don't think I told you the size, but I believe it's 40 by 50. Yes, it's 40 by 50. Sorry about that. I cannot remember if I told you that. Because I record today. Uh, this is not my first video of recording. I could be a little bit mistaken something. There, let's get straightened up a little bit so it's... Get rid of those air bubbles. Okay, so in this little canvas we have in here quite a bit colors in here, I would say. So we have a 20 colors in here. Also, we do have a DMC code legend on both sides. Size is 30 by 40 centimeters in here. Looks so beautiful, so colorful. Look at that. And of course, this one. Uh, we do have a few Ziploc bags on the inside with this kit. And this one is not pre-packed. This one we do have an old-fashioned... Well, not exactly old-fashioned. Old-fashioned would be those little tiny packages that are like a separated all. This one is uh, good that it's calculated by computer and packed by computer so everything should be here unless computer making a mistake so we have 20 in here 20 yes yeah we do we need a 20 colors only in here so let's see those gorgeous purple because they are so gorgeous no joke beautiful shading and then this is trick Thin, should be yeah this is three thin and some more purple this one more like a purple turn into the dark blue well still I would say family of purple lots of nice and beautiful colors in here like bright colors so it should be very very colorful if you are the one who love colors bright colors I know that lots of people like only muted colors more like vintage soft pastels I like everything that shine and sparkle sometimes I like to have a colors being soft and pastels sometimes I like the brightest and then better depends on your mood you can pick whatever you like oh this pink is gorgeous looks kind of brighter Oh, okay, from far you kind of see more natural color of them, what I see. When I go close, it looks a little bit different color. So from this one, look, those two colors look so good together. And then, wow, love, 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 love this combo. Gorgeous, gorgeous, very beautiful. I love it. Well, I have to love it, right? Because I'm the one who picked this diamond painting. So obviously, I wouldn't pick something that I don't like unless somebody requests to review and I would do that. Uh, but usually, I like to choose something that I would be pleasant. Would be pleasant to work for me and interesting for you. I think by now you already learned my taste, what I like to review 
and I think this is the one that it's Christmas and it's stunning canvas feels really stiff actually really like a hard canvas poinsettia flowers look at that look at the colors are so vibrant in here it feels like you're looking in a real plant flower but it's so colorful let me let me fix a little bit uh, I see the clear sheet in here are so close to the edge barely covering kind of cut not straight and it's gonna be attempting to flip on another side hopefully not let me be very careful here really trying to kind of like a fold in here Oh, look at that print, I'm so bright. Let me just leave it like this right now. Hopefully it doesn't flip. Oh, it does, ah, oh, it does flip in. But that's the right side because it's so static. It's very, very static. Let me hold it this way. Look, look at the brightness of it. It's so pretty. Here's the clothes for the canvas for you. Wow love it this plants definitely bring a cheer and joy to the house at the christmas time i love to see how you know from green leaves all of a sudden it turn and it's amazing because it, in some point it doesn't even look like a flower it looks like a just a regular leaves that turn into different colors but they are gorgeous and i thought this image are so beautiful that I have to have it and work somewhere before Christmas or even over Christmas time. I don't care when I will have my Christmas tree in the house. It will be such a cheery and beautiful time to work on something as gorgeous as this canvas. So it's a 40 by 30 centimeters. And in here we have 20 colors. Very light print for the numbers kind of barely visible but DMC all right it's a little bit very tiny print in here I would say have about bags itself okay this one we have a regular toolkit in here I'm sure you all already know what's included in a toolkit or do we still have beginners anybody in here who never done diamond painting yet please let me know and if you have any questions, you more than welcome join our Facebook group Lovecraft Forever. And you can learn a lot from everybody in the group. Very, very friendly, chatty group. Always will come to you and help if you have any questions. If you this is your like a first time doing diamond paintings. So we have around diamonds. And let's just say this is two bags of the same green color because we have a lot of green in here. Lots of shades of red and pinkish. Oh, this green bright, so pretty. Two colors together, so vibrant. And one more in here, number 20, is this one, bright one, red. What do you think about this diamond painting? Do you like this? It feels like it's made of the real picture, just like a photograph turned into the diamond painting because it doesn't look like it was a painting or something. To me, it looks like real flowers. And I really like it. I think they did a good job on this one. I really, really love this image. It looks so good on a website when you look like a big picture up there. Go and check it out. Now we have one more left, something little. 
let's see let's see and I have some more crustage to review as the reminder it's going to be like you know um, series of four parts of video so one big haul we unboxed in my first video check it out what we have up there and what we have in here okay so this is kind of new style that they brought recently uh, to every store and everyday crafts have them as well uh, this one kit also have some ziplock bags extra which is always nice to have uh, round diamonds uh, I would say they created this images for diamond painting from quillen cards that people post uh, that's what my idea because this is definitely a paper craft whatever is going on in this picture and they just decided to create diamond paintings from it so I would love to know if you like this kind of diamond paintings or not I never uh, create one yet and this is actually the very very first one that I review on my channel this kind of style and if you following me on my channel you probably remember that I did video unboxing review of quill and supplies tools papers and I would love to get back to the paper craft as well and create few um, not like tutorials but just uh, tested out those tools brand new one and create some flowers this is definitely a shaped rose flowers from the paper so maybe this is not exactly quilling on this no I think that the leaves in, in here it's a quilted um, from the paper roses could be punched out petals and shape it out I can't really tell right now from this picture so we have to see this picture on our website so definitely go and check it out uh, I, I like this one they have lots of like this kind of, uh, for the Christmas time with Christmas designs so please check it out I think it's interesting going like a cluster of the flowers I like that it's a 30 by 40 centimeters and have 24 colors Diamonds in here, round shape. I like that doesn't have a circles around, so this is canvas is ni ni like nice and good clarity. Look at that, good clarity. How about darker place? Also good. Sorry for the reflection. I need to have artificial light, otherwise it would be very dark. Those daytime you know sunny days summer time is gone so now without light it would be too dark to record video so we have to have this little bit inconvenient reflection from my chandelier but there see I try to kind of point it out for you as much as possible to see actual color with no reflection and look at this boom look at the brightness of this this oh my goodness so pretty this is DMC code 608 and yellow 741 oh I love this one so bright and then more yellow brighter and lighter this is two bags of the same color lots of yellow obviously will be go for the background 11, 12, 13, what is this, dark, dark brown, 14, dark green, 15, 16, 17, 18, that's a pretty color as well, 961 DMC code. 992 DMC codes for this one aqua um at like a tail color I love this one color and then we have a few more colors in here oh where is our focus gun okay and in here we have 20 this one color is beautiful as well 
3340. So 3340. That's okay. There. Very pretty color. 21. 22. 23. And 24. Perfect count of diamonds. Nothing is missing. I don't know if uh, ever any like a diamonds missing lately. I think they are pretty good lately on account. But the only thing one time um, not long ago I did video unboxing and I cannot remember if it's already on air or it's still uh, scheduled for my video on a YouTube channel that a size was right and wrong. Remember uh, size was saying 30 by 40 but actual canvas was 30 by 30. So yes it could be some kind of mistake so it's good to you know give an extra time and check it out so you don't make a mistake. Like you know if you would order from the website and they will send you wrong size of course you will complain about it right? Because if you see on a website it says 30 by 40 and all of a sudden you receive 30 by 30, yeah, you want your money back or you want a new canvas. That wouldn't be acceptable. So it's good to actually know and of course I did email and tell to the company about this mistake because obviously if it's on one website it would be the same mistake on all, all the website that mostly website that I've reviewed they kind of uh, same factory from same supplier so it would be a mistake everyone so it's you know important to um, any little error to report to them so they can fix a mistake at least make a different uh, number on a website and maybe lower the price because the canvas is smaller. Now I'm keep staring on this image on a, on a camera viewpoint. Those roses look so good in here. I really really like and it's make me kind of like a nostalgic to I want to create roses. I love I used to work many hours per day just to create flowers from the paper or ribbons. I have bucket of flowers. I should show you maybe one day and we will take the favorite ones and maybe we will create some paper flowers. But for now we are going to diamond paint something like this. Well I have to say that I'm surprised that this canvas looks really good. So this is new style kind of like a quill, paper quill designs but in diamond paintings. I kind of I was wondering how this is going to look like good or not and then I saw on Instagram my friend from Germany hey 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 um, I think that was you the one who was uh, creating this diamond painting this kind of style and I kind of liked it and I de definitely did not regret this is, looks go good really good I like it. Well, thank you so much for watching everybody. Thank you so much Everyday Crafts for the beautiful product. And I will see you in my next review. Of course, tomorrow, next day, I will see you with some other video. Have a good day everyone.